You're listening to Do This Work, a daily personal development podcast that focuses on science-backed, actionable steps towards your best year ever. Hi, I'm Santa, your host. Today, we're continuing with our 10 most influential CEOs of the 20th century series, this time around with John C. Vogel, known as Jack Vogel. He was an American entrepreneur and investor who is best known for founding the Vanguard Group and pioneering low-cost index fund investing. John C. Vogel was born on May 8, 1929 in Montclair, New Jersey. He graduated from Princeton University in 1951, and he began his career at Wellington Management Company. At Wellington, he rose to the position of president and CEO. In 1974, John C. Vogel founded the legendary Vanguard Group, a mutual fund company that would go on to revolutionize the investment industry. Two years later, in 1976, Vogel introduced a game-changing financial product, the Vanguard 500 Index Fund. This fund was the first of its kind, offering individual investors the opportunity to passively track the performance of the entire U.S. stock market, specifically the S&P 500 index, at a remarkably low cost. The Vanguard 500 index funds approach was simple yet very powerful. Rather than relying on expensive fund managers to pick specific stocks in an attempt to outperform the market, Bogle's index fund aimed to replicate the performance of the broader market index by holding the exact same stock in the same proportion as the S&P 500. The fund allowed investors to achieve broad market diversification and capture the overall market's returns minus a minimal fee for fund management. This pioneering concept of index fund investing represented a seismic shift in the financial industry. Bogle's approach challenged the prevailing wisdom that active management, he emphasized that by minimizing costs such as management fees and trading expenses, investors could keep more of their investment gains over the long term. He was right. Additionally, the simplicity and transparency of index funds appealed to investors seeking a straightforward and low effort way to participate in the stock market. The Vanguard 500 index fund's success for the explosive growth of passive investing and index funds over the following decade, still, still, still very strong. Vogel's vision and persistence in promoting the benefits of low cost, long-term investing continue to shape the investment landscape today. Bogle's revolutionary approach influenced not only individual investors, but also institutional investors, financial advisors, and the broader asset management industry. Bogle quite literally pioneered the concept of index fund investing for individual investors. He also established Vanguard as a client-owned mutual fund company where the funds are managed for the benefit of the shareholders. Even though Bogle was unbelievably talented, a genius really, and successful, not everyone in the industry was enamored with his groundbreaking approach. While Bogle achieved immense success in revolutionizing the mutual fund industry, we could argue that his failure may have come from his challenges and getting the broader financial industry to fully embrace his philosophy of low-cost, long-term index investing. He faced skepticism and resistance from many traditional investors and financial professionals who favored active management strategies and high-fee structures. Bogle was known for his integrity, his vision, and his dedication to serving the interests of individual investors. His leadership style was characterized by a focus on long-term value creation, transparency, and a commitment to putting the client's interests first. He was also known for his humility and willingness to challenge established industry norms 
for the greater good of investors. Here are a couple of very relevant lessons we can glean from Bogle's career and leadership style. Number one, his focus on the long term. Bogle played the long game. His emphasis on long-term investing and patience in the face of market volatility can teach us the importance of staying the course and not being swayed by short-term fluctuations. Bogle's emphasis on long-term investing and patience in the face of market volatility encapsulates a timeless lesson in financial wisdom. Bogle advocated for a steady and patient approach to investing. This mindset encourages investors to remain calm during periods of market turbulence, avoid making emotional decisions driven by fear or greed, and stay committed to your long-term financial plan. By adopting a long-term perspective, investors can benefit from the power of compounding returns, weather market volatility more effectively, and avoid costly mistakes that can hinder wealth accumulation over time. Ultimately, Vogel's advocacy for long-term investing serves as a reminder that enduring success in the financial markets often comes from consistency, resilience, and a focus on the bigger picture rather than being swayed by temporary market noise or short-lived trends. And that really applies to almost every part of life. Another leadership lesson from Bogle, cost matters. Bogle's advocacy for low-cost investing highlights the impact that fees and expenses can have on long-term returns. He showed that minimizing costs can significantly benefit investors over time. Bogle's advocacy for low-cost investing was not merely a passing recommendation, but a fundamental principle that reshaped the investment landscape. By highlighting the impact of fees and expenses on long-term returns, he shed light on a crucial yet often overlooked aspect of investing. Bogle's seminal work revealed that seemingly small costs such as management fees, administrative expenses, and trading commissions can compound over time and erode a significant portion of an investor's returns. He emphasized that every dollar paid in fees is a dollar less working for the investor's benefit in the market. Bogle's pioneering efforts in promoting low-cost investing through index funds revolutionized how investors think about expenses and their impact on investment performance. He demonstrated that by choosing low-cost investment products such as index funds and minimal management fees, investors could retain more of their hard-earned money and capture a larger share of market returns over the long term. The focus on cost efficiency was not just a matter of saving money in the short run, but a strategic approach to enhancing investment outcomes and building wealth steadily over time. Also, Bogle's insistence on cost-conscious investing resonated with investors of all backgrounds by democratizing access to low-cost investment options that were previously available mainly to institutional investors. He believes that by lowering barriers to entry and advocating for transparency and fee structure, individual investors could benefit from fairer and more efficient markets. Bogle's enduring legacy as a champion of low-cost investing continues to inspire investors to scrutinize expenses and seek out cost-effective investment solutions and prioritize maximizing their returns by minimizing unnecessary costs. In essence, Bogle's message underscores that when it comes to investing, cost matters significantly and paying attention to fees can make a substantial difference in achieving long-term financial success. Another leadership lesson from Bogle, integrity and advocacy. Bogle's unwavering commitment to integrity, transparency, and advocating for investors' interests serves as a reminder of the importance of ethical leadership and standing up for what you believe is right. Bogle's unwavering commitment to integrity, transparency, and advocating for investors' interests stands as a beacon of ethical leadership in a world often clouded by conflicts of interest 
and short-sighted decision-making. His dedication to putting investors' needs first exemplifies a moral compass that guided his actions throughout the entirety of his career. By prioritizing integrity in all aspects of his work, Mogul set a standard for principled leadership that continues to resonate across the financial industry and beyond. Through his advocacy for transparency, Bogle aimed to empower investors with the knowledge and insight necessary to make informed decisions about their financial futures. His efforts to demystify complex financial concepts and expose hidden investment costs reflected a deep-rooted belief in the importance of honesty and openness in cultivating trust between financial institutions and their clients. Vogel's commitment to transparency not only helped shape the way investors approach financial decision-making, but also inspired a broader conversation about accountability and responsibility within the industry. Vogel's relentless advocacy for investors' interests underscored the transformative impact of standing up for what is just and equitable. In an era marked by rapid globalization, evolving regulations, and complex financial products, Vogel steadfast believe in the fundamental rights of investors to fair treatment and ethical stewardship really served as a powerful catalyst for change. By challenging prevailing norms and championing the cause of individual investors, Vogel demonstrated that true leadership is rooted in courage, in conviction, and in a deep-seated commitment to doing what is right, even in the face of adversity. In essence, Vogel's legacy as a trailblazer in promoting integrity and advocating for investors' rights serves as a poignant reminder of the enduring value of ethical leadership in shaping a more transparent, equitable, and sustainable financial ecosystem. His profound influence continues to inspire leaders across industries to uphold the highest standards of integrity, to prioritize ethical decision-making, and champion the interests of those that they serve, thereby leaving a lasting legacy that transcends mere financial success. Mogul made investing easy and accessible for everyone. He exemplified the investing process, offering individuals a straightforward and cost-effective way to participate in the financial market. By introducing the concept of passive investing, through index funds, Vogel provided a reliable investment option that aligned with the principles of diversification and long-term growth, all while minimizing costs and complexity. Vogel's emphasis on low-cost investing not only made it more accessible for individual investors to participate in the market, but also democratized access to investment opportunities that were traditionally reserved for institutional investors. By eliminating the need for active stock picking and high fees associated with actively managed funds, Vogel leveled the playing field for all investors, enabling them to benefit from broad market exposure and capturing market returns with minimal effort and expense. This inclusivity in investing empowered individuals to take control of their financial futures, build wealth steadily over time, and achieve their long-term financial goals without being encumbered by unnecessary barriers or fees. Vogel's relentless advocacy for simplicity and transparency in investing fostered a culture of education and empowerment among investors, encouraging them to focus on the fundamentals of long-term investing rather than chasing short-term gains or following market trends. By promoting a disciplined and a patient approach to investing based on sound principles, Vogel not only made investing more accessible, but also instilled a sense of confidence 
and trust in individuals navigating the complexities of the financial market. His legacy as a champion of easy, inexpensive, and inclusive investing continues to resonate with investors worldwide, inspiring them to embrace a more accessible and sustainable approach to building wealth and securing their financial futures. And we're all grateful for Jack Vogel, absolutely amazing financial genius. If you like what you're hearing, don't forget to leave a review, follow and subscribe to my YouTube channel at Do This First. You can also read a full transcript of this podcast episode and all 147 podcast episodes and counting on my blog, Do This First.life. You can also sign up for my new weekly newsletter, which will help you get your week started on a positive note and updates on coaching, books, merch, and my public speaking engagements as they become available. Tomorrow, we'll continue with our 10 part series on the most influential CEOs of the 20th century. Till tomorrow.